I mean, maybe no one is actually from anywhere. It's so hard to trace these things, right? I just rolled out of bed one morning and had this head full of good hair. And when I say good hair, I mean it was passed down from someone who was once dragged through a field by it until their scalp became a wide open mouth. But it looks good underneath this fitted hat on the dance floor. No, you cannot borrow this dance. No, you cannot stand over another dark and shaking body and breathe in the smoke we leave in our wake. I get that we are all human or whatever, but I don't even know what that would do to your bones. I don't know if your bones bend like my bones. I come from a boxed-in culture. I come from people who traveled entire oceans wrapped around each other. I was born to a woman who is now inside of a box. So you see, some things just come natural to me, but maybe you're right, though. Maybe there is no such thing as a country. Maybe it's just gutted earth and rows of sharp teeth that never stop tearing at my flesh. So I'm not exactly sure which wound is the wound I belong to anymore. I'm saying I don't even know what my own skin looks like unless it is split open and spilling. So it gets a little hard to keep track, right? I'm just saying it must be nice to wrap your arms around an unscathed body. It must be nice to wrap your tongue around every word in a song without also asking to bleed out on a sidewalk. Look, all I know is I began running once the fire started and I have not stopped since. Maybe I come from running. Maybe running is a country. Maybe everyone who lives there misses someone who they thought would live forever. I'm glad you haven't found it yet. I'm glad that you haven't caught me yet. I'm glad you have a black friend. I'm sorry your black friend may die one day soon and then there will only be me.